Possessing this poor, poor, homeless person. It doesn't matter. I will find Carly and I will take down the realm. Nonsense. If I, if my real body was here right now, he'd be dead. But now if I had to take possession of this, uh, this lame body, what's wrong? Mortal. But that's the thing. They're weak in mortal bodies. So. I could just take your ass right now. And I could just continue on with my day. Do whatever you want. We can be ruined. My mentors and my servants are here following you. Making sure that you never ever find Carly. And if you do, I'll make sure that I kill her with my own hands. Oh, uh, conversation over. Wait a minute, does this mean that Lord Nicole already knew that she didn't know where Carly was? I pretty much think so, otherwise she wouldn't have confronted Liana right now. Wow, things are about to get serious right here. Just by looking at this, we can already tell that Liana's been killing all the vampires lately here. That left the vampire room. Liana's very strong. That means that no one will get in her way to find Carly. I must admit that she's kind of skilled, but she cannot be Nicole. All this just for a 12 year old werewolf. <laughs> Maybe I'm totally fine. Well, uh, where did you even go last night? I was really worried about you. I was even about to call the cops. <sighs> Nobody even cared I was gone but you. So who cares? Really, who cares? Oh, what's wrong, Carly? You look really upset. Are you okay? Is it about that Houston boy? He has a girlfriend, Priscilla. He has a freaking girlfriend. Oh, Carly, I'm sorry. I know he was a good friend of yours and you were really trying to get along. I'm really sorry. He even invited me to this, to this stupid girlfriend's party tonight. I'm not even sure if I should go. Going to a party is a perfect benefit for you to make friends. I think you should go. 
Even though if he has a girlfriend, I think it's a perfect time to make friends and forget about Houston. It's perfect. You should go. I thought you said I was grounded. What happened to that? Well, I'm ungrounding you for tonight. You're going, okay? You gotta make new friends. Well, what if I don't want to go? Can't I just stay home? You can't force me to go somewhere I don't want to. Carly, you are going to that party whether you like it or not to make new friends. You are going tonight. That is an order. <sighs> Come on, Nicole, are you ready to play some games? Yeah, let's play. Uh, Bonnie? Uh, where's Liana? I really don't like know. Like, she totally just like walked out when I showed her Liana. And I was like, um, maybe she's scared of babies? I don't know, but she totally left and we didn't get to do our projects. So now I'm just playing with cute little Nicole. <gasps> it's not my Nicole. It's not right. Well, someone looks a bit grumpy. Yeah, she's been all fussy since her nap and I was like, um, okay, and now she doesn't even want to like make any baby sounds like any baby is supposed to make. And now I'm trying to cheer, cheer her up with her favorite toys, but that's not really helping at all. <laughs> Come on, Nicole, don't you want to play with your favorite toys? Mm -mm. No? Come on, you know you like playing with Mr. Bunny. Look, you see? Mr. Bunny. Oh, okay. You don't want to play with Mr. Bunny. I'll go find another toy. Maybe she's just tired. Come on, just let her go take a nap, okay? Let's just leave her alone. Let's leave her on a blanket. Come on. Okay. Well, I'm gonna let you be just for a little bit, okay? I'll be right back and you take a nice nap. We are back, my lord. <sighs> oh, it looks like Fiona has proven herself very well on how strong she can be. She doesn't take no mercy on any vampires. Uh, apparently not, my lord, but, um, but we did find out that Leona has not found a young master yet. That is perfect. Her powers are barely settling in, and that means she won't be able to control it that well, and that is perfect. Tonight won't be her lucky night. But my lord, that means she would reveal all the supernatural powers and that would re reveal the supernatural world. Exactly. That's why I want you to follow Liana tonight, wherever she's going, because Liana knows exactly what's going to go down tonight. So you need to follow her and see where she goes. Mm -hmm. Follow? Again? Nuh-uh. Heck no. Hell to the no. No, no. She's like the most boring werewolf in the whole wide world. And the stupidest planet. And all she does is nothing but follow things and read. And no, 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 no. Never again. No. Dawn, shut up before she hits you. You, you know, know what? what? You're right. She's has been working very too hard, and she's a very, very boring. Why don't you guys stay here for the rest of the night while I do all the work? Don't worry about a single thing, okay? Uh, um, okay? Well then, the sun is setting, I must be off. Uh, but, uh, but, my lord, won't they notice that you're gone? Y yeah, they're gonna notice that you're gone. I want you to make sure that they don't come in this room. That's what I'm leaving you in charge for. My lord, that's gonna be a little bit hard to, ch to do. I mean, this is their room after all. They are gonna come in here and check on you. Well, don't try to with that before she even wanna go. Now I have to do all the work and now you have to take my cover. Have a nice night, girls. You better fucking run before I fucking slap you, you little- ah! Oh, there's a lot of people here.
Houston. 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 Oh. Hey, you want some beer? Not from you, thanks. <laughs> Catherine, she actually came to my party. Isn't that surprising? Well, not really. Ugh, whatever. Where's Houston? I need to be with him to make her jealous. Because no one else could have Houston but me. She needs to learn that. Uh, well, he's over there with the guys. Well, TTYL. And then I said, that's not grape jam, that's pineapple jam. <laughs> Uh, Houston, there you are. The music sounds pretty good. You want to dance? Uh, Hillary, are you okay? You never asked me to dance with you before. Well, this is, well, this is my party. I think we should dance. So, come on. We're dancing. Okay, well, I guess I'll see you later, Houston. Yeah, bye, Houston. Have fun with your chaotic girlfriend. I'm not gonna find him in this park because there's too many people. Hey, you want company? Uh, sure. Let me guess, you came here, you were someone invited you, but, um, what the call it? Uh, you can't find him in the party, and now you're just here, stuck in the corner. Just here, wishing for a blunt. Oh, well, yeah, but not the blunt part. It's always best to come to a party stoked because. <sighs> well, Makes you feel better in life. So, let me give you some tips, kid. Probably thinking that he ditched you and shit, and yeah. Hey, but if you did, I want you to go out there, look for that person that invited you, and kick their ass for ditching you. That makes you feel 100% better than buying a cappuccino. Um, uh, okay. So, stop standing here and looking like a fucking moaner and just go out there and party. And for my advice, you might want to lay off the lead. I'm tired. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's with his girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny, Houston. <laughs> oh, Catherine, there she is. The way she is staring at us is so hilarious. Hi. <laughs> Why don't I have these hair a bit more? Mwah. Who the hell does she think she is to put her paws all around him? Not my friend. He's my friend. Why does he have his hands all over her? Does he not care how I feel? Uh, hey, what's with all the kisses? You never kissed me like this before. Is something going on, Hillary? What? Of course not. I'm just giving my boyfriend some love. Is there something wrong with that? No. Okay. Well, I'm going to get some drinks. So I'll be right back. You hear that, you little bitch? He is mine and he's going to get me a drink. There is seriously no way on this earth that he would go out with a guy like you. I mean, look at you. You're so horrible and disgusting looking. I swear, if she says one more thing, I'm gonna fucking punch her in the throat. She's hurting me so much. Houston and I have been together for like a long, long, long time, and I don't think a girl like you is gonna ruin our relationship, okay? No, your relationship was never perfect. You always ruined everything. You're just giving him all this love to make me jealous. It's taking my friend away from me. Your relationship, your love, it isn't real. You're just dating him just because for popularity. Your relationship isn't real. Besides, everyone agrees that you're all disgusting and gross. If I ask Houston, he might as well say, say the same thing. Listen, you don't belong here. Why don't you just go back wherever you came from and never come back? For Houston's sake. <sighs> Where am I? Huh? Uh, 
Animus. Uh, yes. Do you or do you not remember being at a party last night? A, a, a party? A, a party? I, I don't remember quite. Yeah. Carly Nemes, do you or do you not remember killing Hillary last night at the party? What? I don't. What are you talking about? I don't remember anything about killing anybody. I wouldn't. I, I, I wouldn't. But apparently, you did kill someone last night, Carly Nemes, and now you don't. You don't have to hide it. We all know. We. You just need to confess. All the witnesses saw it last night. You killing Hillary last night. Bullshit! That is all wrong! I swear I didn't kill anybody! I wouldn't! Harley, please, this is hurting me. Please just confess the truth. It's okay if you do. No! I mean, no! I don't even know what you guys are talking about. Why should I? I mean, I don't even know. Please! You're at Hillary's party. And the next thing you know, Hillary was in a coma covered in blood all over her head. She died in the middle of the night. And her coma. And you are the cause of her death. All the witnesses said it. So quit complaining and lie and confess the truth. I am confessing the truth. I did not say anything. I did not kill anybody. I swear. Well, since she does not want to confess, let's put a little bit more water in. No, no, please don't. No. This really does hurt me. But all your behavior acts up to this, and this is the only thing I could do for you to get better. I'm sorry, Carly. Priscilla, don't! 